Hi guys, welcome back to Recipes Mania. Today we are going to be doing Crystal's recipe that she is calling Cocoa Puffs Delight. So let's get started. Okay, now I don't know about you, but I haven't had Cocoa Puffs in a long time. Yeah, me neither. I used to eat them all the time when I was a kid. Yeah, they were one of my favorites. Tell me about it. Okay, so we're going to take the box of Cocoa Puffs and we're going to layer a lot on the bottom and we'll be right back. And we have our nonstick spray on the pan. Yes. All right, the Cocoa Puffs are on. What's next, Crystal? Next. You're going to slather them in uh, molasses. Right, we've got our jar of molasses right here. And we'll pour some of that on. All right. How's that? Perfect. All right, now what? Now, we'll be right back because we're going to warm up the peanut butter to make it easier to work. All right, well, that was a good idea. So we've got our peanut butter here. We use a small jar of um, Skippy creamy peanut butter, and we've melted it, so it's now a lot easier to work with, and we can pour it over our um, Cocoa Puffs and molasses. And that was courtesy of my mom. Thanks, yep, thank mom. you. Actually, she bought all these ingredients. Thanks, Mom. Yep, thank you, Linda. Now we can just spread that out. All right. How's that looking so far? That looks good. I bet your family is going to tear into this like yep. nobody's business. Oh yeah. All right, what's next? The caramel chips. All right, we've got Nestle Toll House uh, caramel flavored morsels. Nice caramel morsels. Should we use the whole bag? Oh yeah. All right. Chocolate, peanut butter, and caramel, three of my favorite things. All right, this looks good. All right. Should we get this in the oven? Yep, and that was the last ingredient. So now we're gonna put it in the oven for 20, well, 20 minutes with the lid on and 20 minutes with the lid off. The lid off first, of course. Okay, what temperature? At um, 400. All right. All right, it is done. We're going to suggest not leaving it for quite as long as what we had originally said because it is a little bit well done. But I'm sure it'll still taste great. And we have some here ready to taste right now. Mmm, it's really good. Hope you try it for yourself. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you back here next time on Recipes Mania. Bye, guys.